Hey there friends, thanks for checking in and welcome to another video in my series One handgun, one shotgun, and one rifle. The handgun that I'm featuring today is a handgun that I'm pretty sure all you are aware of. It's become so ordinary that it's often overlooked and that's the M&P 9 compact size 2.0. They increased the stippling on the grip, making it very nice. It's a duty gun, so a lot of people like that. Comparable to a Glock 19, it has stood the test of time. It does have a four inch barrel sight hole indicator, a hinged trigger, pick rail, three dot sights. And I'm bringing it back with this series because I don't like it that it's overlooked when so many people love this gun. The shield's not overlooked, but it's become ordinary and pretty commonplace in the gun world. Let's see how it fires. I tried to move my shots all around that coyote. Let's go for a neck shot. There it is. Another one. And there we go. Smith & Wesson M&P Compact 2.0 and 9mm. Definitely a worthy choice. Now let's get to that shotgun. The shotgun that I'm featuring today is the new Rock Island VR PA40. Pump action, box fed shotgun with a 20 inch barrel, fiber optic front sight, a rail, adjustable rear sight, polymer stock, and these are also available with nine and 19 round magazines. It'll accept two and three quarter and three inch shells. I've got one in the chamber here, cross bolt safety engaged. But more importantly, I have a coyote target there that needs to be shot. Let's see how this new model performs. And there we go. I think it performed quite well. Now let's get to that rifle. The rifle that I'm featuring today is my Ruger American Ranch Rifle chambered in 350 Legend. The 350 Legend is a straight walled cartridge. It's new, it's made by Winchester, and this round is called an Extreme Point. It's a, it's a deer hunting round, good for up to 250 yards in my estimation. I was able to shoot 285 yards and was very successful with that, but for hunting purposes right around 200 to 250 it should work just fine the rifle itself does have a flat dark earth polymer stock a 16.3 inch barrel a magazine that holds five rounds of 350 legend i've got three loaded up right now and the optic that i have here is a vortex diamondback three by nine by 40. and i i really like this setup i i find the the round to be very effective, it's a nice round, it's a smooth shooting round, and it's not that expensive. So I've got a target set up probably 85 yards away. Let's see how this does. And it hits hard. I mean, it really hits hard. 85 yards is like, it's nothing. I'm hitting that dead nuts too. I fall in love with the cartridge itself. It's a smooth shooter and each time I've taken it to the range I backed up a little bit more, a little bit more and it's performed very well. I think 300's pushing it. I wouldn't go 300 again. I'd stick between 250 and shorter. And there it is. Ruger American Ranch Rifle chambered in 350 Legend. Thanks for watching another video in my series called one handgun, one shotgun, and one rifle. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.